Hey, you know, I have this problem. Crazy shit. Crazy shit seems to happen around me. It might happen to me. It might happen in front of me. It might happen with an earshot. Somehow or another, crazy shit happens. For example, how many people do you know who have fallen down a manhole? When I say fallen down a manhole, I'm talking about Coyote Roadrunner. The coyote going down the manhole. You know, boom. How many people do you know who have done that? How many people do you know who have almost married a pygmy princess? How about who have eaten a living termite? How many people do you know who have done that? Well, I'd like to give you one little example of something crazy that happened to me. And it happened many years ago one night when I went to Santa Barbara. I was sleeping on the beach. And you might be asking, why was I sleeping on the beach? Well, I was traveling across country. I had been hitchhiking, taking a bus, driving, a variety of ways. And I could have stayed at a YMCA or a guest house or something, but I was in Santa I was in Santa Barbara and I was on the beach and I thought, hey, I'm going to sleep on the beach here. This is really cool. I've never slept on a beach before. So that's what I did. So I unrolled up I unrolled my sleeping bag, I got inside of it, used my backpack as a pillow, and I went to sleep. Uh in the background here, you can kind of see the view of what I saw when I was uh sleeping on the beach. This is the pier of S Santa Barbara. Well, in the, I slept. I guess I slept fine. I don't really remember. I, I went to bed around two or three in the morning. Why I went to bed so late? Well, that's another story. I'll get into that another time. Uh, but I woke up around sunrise, which this was February, so I'm guessing that was around six o'clock in the morning. So in in at sunrise, you pr I saw something like this. You know, the beach coming in and everything. But instead of just seeing the beach, I saw this um kind of like this hippie like this hippie dude looking guy uh hippie like looking dude uh he had long hair and it was hanging down from both sides and i'm looking straight up and i see his hair coming down at me and he says to me you kgb and i said what and he said you kgb i'm cia and i said what and i'm like i'm thinking is this guy crazy and he points out to the ocean. I guess it's this way. <laughs> he points out to the ocean. The submarines there. We have to go. And I look out to the ocean, and I don't see any submarine. But I do see that my sleeping bag is getting wet because the tide is coming in and the waves are getting my sleeping bag wet. So I quickly pull in my sleeping bag, and then I turn around to look for the guy, and he's gone. Where is this guy? And I, I start looking around. And uh, you can see in this map behind me, uh, this, is a, this is a picture of the beach and you can see uh, basically where I was sleeping. Behind me there was kind of a cliff and uh, walking maybe a hundred yards to one way, you can come to um, a road in a parking lot and some um, cars. Well, I went looking for this guy and he was nowhere to be found. I followed his footsteps from the sleeping bag and I went to the cliff where some bushes were and his footsteps stopped right there. And I could find him. I could, couldn't see where they picked up. But I went looking. I went running towards the road. I didn't see him. I went looking everywhere. And I went back and I looked at the footsteps, his foot tracks in the sand. They just stopped there. It made no sense. I looked back at the ocean. There was no submarine. I looked all around the cliff face and around the bush. There was no secret door or cave or anything. And I went back to my sleeping bag. And I just was wondering, who was that guy? Was he just some guy tripping and he's just warning me to get my sleeping bag out of the water? Or was he really CIA? I'll never know. What I do have to say is, that is the weirdest thing that I ever saw when waking up in the morning. Can you tell me what the weirdest thing is you ever saw waking up in the morning? Uh, behind me now, this is the actual photograph that I took. This was at sunrise in Santa Barbara. So let me know, uh, what was the weirdest thing you ever saw when you woke up in the morning?